Rodney McGruder was torn apart by Draymond Green and Klay Thompson after the Warriors game against the Pistons. You guys have to see this. Hey guys, it's Devin Howard. If you wanna follow me on Instagram, you can find me there as at Devin Howard. Double check that you've subscribed to The Fumble, tap the bell for notifications, and don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Rodney McGruder. To the casual NBA fan, his name is not a household one. But now I think we'll all remember who he is, and maybe for all the wrong reasons. The Warriors met the Pistons on the court on Saturday night, and Rodney was in the game for the final six minutes. He headed toward the Warriors bench after the buzzer straight for Juan Toscano Anderson, apparently questioning a comment that the Warriors player directed toward Wayne Ellington during the first half. He got really aggressive, which caused Clay Thompson to sort of clap back and comment on it while he was reporting on the sidelines. Check out that clip here. I don't know. This dude might be out the league soon. He's probably mad about that. Who knows? Wow. Shots fired. <laughs> he's over here checking my guy, trying to start something like he's a good player or something. It's like, bro, easy, get out of here. Easy. You might be. A Sorry. All right. We're done. Easy. Wow. He really didn't hold anything back. And he wasn't the only Warriors player to call out Rodney. Draymond Green also delivered delivered a nearly two minute speech that basically just roasted the athlete. I have a clip for you here. You guys have to see this. Walk over there talking like he's a team tough guy. Get the hell out of here. Tough guy, Rodney, Rodney. Tough guy. I think it was something that like that Juan said in the first or second quarter to Wayne Ellington. You ain't got nothing better to do that you still thinking about something from the first or second quarter when you weren't in the game. Clay and Draymond were fully supporting their teammates and Rodney's teammates did the same thing. Wayne Ellington heard all the drama and decided to speak out in defense of Rodney. He said that the way Draymond and Clay attacked Rodney's career was unprofessional and not classy. He also said that the blame could be placed squarely on Juan's shoulders. He said that Rodney is a man of respect and any drama that occurred wouldn't have been his fault. He also said, quote, for Draymond to sit up there and talk all that crazy stuff behind a microphone, I think that's the fake tough guy stuff to be honest with you. Yikes, shots were certainly fired both on the court and off the court for these two teams. What do you guys think about what went down? Do you think that Clay and Draymond did the right thing? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and tap the bell. I'm Devin Howard for The Funvel, and I'll see you later.